coming to River in the Hills. So happy that you're here today. Um, I'm just going to simply just read uh, two verses and just pray for us. And I'm just praying that as I read these verses, I just feel like the Holy Spirit, um, he's going to speak something very specific to each of you. So in Hebrews 2, 17 and 18, it says, this is why we had to be, this is why he had to be a man. They talk about Jesus and take hold of our humanity in every way. He made us his brothers and sisters and became our merciful and faithful king priest before God as the one who removed our sins to make us one with him. He suffered and endured every test and temptation so that he can help us every time we pass through the ordeals of life. We just thank you, Jesus, for this promise. We thank you 
for what this means for each of us, that you know what it means to be tempted. You know what it means to learn how to talk, to learn how to walk, to be um, and scolded by our parents. You know what that sounded like, what that, what that looks like. You understand what it means to be human. But because you are fully God, you are here for us. You come near. So I just pray right now that through you, Lord, that we would find freedom. We would find um, just a peace that surpasses all understanding. I thank you, Lord, that those verses, I think that they were like destroying boxes that we put you in, destroying boxes that we put God in, destroying the, the, the ideas that we have about you. So I just pray right now that your Holy Spirit would come and fill this place. I thank you from hearts of thanksgiving as we're thankful for what you've done for us, Lord, that you will meet us in that place. So we thank you, Jesus. Amen. Standing 
just give you glory as they stand before your throne here on earth and here on earth we gather to declare your name alone come on sing that again you are holy So 
worship you this morning. Oh God, we say that you alone reign today. We worship you, Yahweh. We worship you, one true living God. We worship you, Holy One of Israel. We say that there is no one like you. We say that there is no one else that's worthy of praise, Lord. We've gathered here in this place today to declare your worth, to enthrone you on our praise, Lord. We love you, Jesus.
Yeah, Lord, we thank you that you're here right now. We welcome you to come even more. We welcome you to increase your presence. We say we feel you in this place right now. We're aware of your presence in this place right now, God, but we're not satisfied yet. We ask for more, God. Increase our appetite today, God. Release the gift of hunger all across this room, God.
Jesus, I love you. 